welcome back. It is time to get the kids going on a Father's Day craft project. Jennifer Ackerman Haywood from the Grand Rapids Press and CraftSanity.com is here to show us a couple easy ideas, so easy that she's brought her own two girls to come and help out with it. <laughs> Hi, girls. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hello. <laughs> All right, you guys, do you do a lot of crafts at home with mom? Mm -hmm. And and you're going to work on something for your dad for Father's Day? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Why do you want to do something special for dad? Do you love him? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is fun because I know you're really an advocate for getting the kids in there and having them try some of these projects. Yeah. And these are the things dad's going to love. Well, and sometimes you stress out over Mother's Day and Father's Day and try to make the perfect gift and it's elaborate and you feel like you're, you're having a breakdown. You know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so what I thought, you know, why not just go for the vanilla wafers? Yes. If you don't have time to bake your own cookies, you know. You could make sugar cookies, but you don't have to. Yes. And then they have, uh, Wilton has this great icing that you just literally squeeze out of the, of the I mean, you just and go to the craft. it's icing that dries it's, hard. Yes, and that's the key. You want, yeah. if you just get icing from the, the store, it's, it's not, not going to dry hard, hard enough. And you do, um, when you're, you're at home, you can microwave this for like 20 seconds. Soften it up for the squeeze. And it softens squeeze. up. So it's, because it's coming out, but it's a lot easier when you have it heated up. Did you get yours at like Mike? I know. I, I actually Michael's went to carries. Joanne's. Michael's carries it. Any yeah. craft store that has any cake decorating supplies and you're supposed to let it because right now you got to let it sit for at least 45 minutes. Yeah. Overnight is probably the best. Yeah. And then the girls here have started um, decorating and these are food writers. Don't use regular markers. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> if you use these food writer markers, you can color right on the cookie on top of that icing. Yeah. And you, you know you can help your kids write. It's hard for little kids to write like messages. You know, you can yeah. say, "I love you, Dad," or um, "Number one, Dad," and or just so cute. Or you do polka dots like we got yes. going here and on the also, confetti cookie. We also what worked we with um, animal crackers. They oh, very made some cute. tigers and some spotted creatures that you won't see in nature. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, and you could actually, if, if your father is an Oreo cookie fiend or has some other cookie from the store, yeah. you can put, I mean, I don't know how much more calories you want to add to cookies, but, oh, come on, but go, go ahead for the occasion, day. squirt some of this uh, icing on, and you're good to go so to decorate. Cute. So, okay, keep working, girls. Okay. We're gonna look at what the so we're going to move on to... Um, a lot of us will get those promotional magnets for your refrigerator. Yeah, they're like a business card yeah, size. Yeah, a business yeah. card, and you, you know, you get, I came into a bunch of these, and um, people know that when they're about to throw things out to give it to me, and I'll find a way <laughs> to do it. So what we did is we cut pieces of paper the size of a business card. Yes. Yeah, I love it. It's really nice. Now, do you guys want to work on some of these? Do you guys want to work on a... Oh, you're going to decorate the magnets Yeah, next. so what they did is Crayolas. just made little drawings. And this doesn't have to be a Father's Day present. This could be any miniature artwork. Uh-huh. And all these are just magnets. And what we did is take the magnet... Yep. And some decoupage medium. This is at all craft stores. Yep. Just put a little... I use this as the glue, too. So you just put this right on top. Use this as the glue. So put a generous amount here. Uh huh. Stick your artwork down. Right on top of right it. Right on top. Smooth mm -hmm. out your air bubbles. And this is the part um, that moms and dads, if you're working with small children, the moms and dads might want to do the the decoupage part, but my girls do it. Um, they use about three times as much <laughs> as I do. <laughs> it has a, a real nice but shine. It has a hard coat when you're done. Uh, yeah, and yeah. then you just let these dry. You can add more coats. And we're actually going to be, the girls and I are going to be at the uh, Fulton Street Artisans Market on Sunday. Doing and this we're going to be, I'm going to be selling my Craft Sanity uh, weaving looms, but we're going to have a section of our booth. The girls want to do make it, take it for other kids. Oh, that's so, so if cute. You, uh, we have abundant magnets here, so if uh, any kids want to come out with their parents and Make a magnet. Okay. We'll have supplies to decorate. And all right. Um, I know you also have bonus instructions on your website for how to make this frame. Yes. But let's talk real quick about Sunday's column. Yeah. Sunday's column is about Lisa Port Portinga, and she um, does has a business called The Empty Nest. Mm -hmm. She makes kitsch jewelry, and it's so cool because she's recycling everything from Scrabble pieces, Legos. Uh, just she makes great buttons, just all kinds of fun stuff. Very that, cool. Um, you'll, it'd be fun to just come out and meet her. She's a nice lady, too. So. All right. Well, girls, I want to thank you for coming and making such cute things for Dad. I love it. I hope you're inspired, too. You can find more information on our website at WZZM13.com. Just click on Take Five Links. Wave, girls. Say, I love you, Daddy. <laughs> Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> up next, we're going to have music from Silversmith. But first, here's what's coming up Monday on Take Five. We'll look at some of the latest gadgets for high-tech dads. Plus, our mom at the movies gives us a look at what parents need to know about the Karate Kid and the A-Team, and we'll have your chance to win passes to see the Newsboys at Muskegon Summer Celebration.